Scott Pohl here, four-time Team USA member, gold medalist at the Pan American Games. And what we're talking about is ball grit and surface adjustment. Why is this so important? Look at it this way. This is the part of the bowling ball that's actually touching the lane. A lot of studies have shown at least three quarters or 75% of ball reaction is having the right surface on the bowling ball. For instance, if that bowling ball is going a little bit too long down the lane, what we're gonna wanna do, look at that bowling ball and grab what's called an Aberlon pad and give it a little bit more surface. We can, for instance, give it a 3,000. We can even go all the way down to a 1,000 if that ball just isn't picking up the right way. Okay, vice versa. Let's say the ball is starting way too early and hooking way too much or just way too soon. We can go to a lot higher grit or even polish the bowling ball if we need to. What pads also do, they create less over under from front to back or side to side, okay? Now we got a couple bowling balls in front of us here. Let's look. This one here is one that's very fresh finish. You can tell hardly any oil on the surface at all. This one here has actually been bowled with a little bit. This one has a lot more of a shine look to it. Okay, what happens to these bowling balls as we use them? Oil gets absorbed in the surface. So what's happening is the tread on this ball is actually going away. It's a lot like think of a car tire as it goes down the road. We gotta get those car tires rotated or even new ones. A great way to do that is we have to bring the surface down to even a lower level. Let's say, for instance, we have to give it possibly even a 500 finish, okay? So I'm going to do that. I'm going to take a 500 finish to this, and what I'm doing is I'm actually opening up the pores or that tread in the ball, and I'm giving a lot better finish. And now just like the ball next to it, I'm going to finish it at a 3,000 finish, okay? And if we wipe this off, and we throw it a few times down the lane, we've opened up the pores on that bowling ball to give it a similar reaction. A lot of people make the mistake of just keep hitting the surface, hitting the surface with two, 3,000 time and time again, and all you're doing is filling up the pores of the ball at that finish. The finishing process that works the best is go down and then go back up. All right, a lot of surface tweaks involved. Very important to have it match up correctly or not. See your pro shop operator and he can help you.